What's good YouTube? It's Queen Chosen, back with another video. It's time to create, inspire, and ascend. In this video, we're going to be talking about meditation and why meditation is so important, especially on your journey to ascension. Let's be real. Most of us have a monkey mind. Our mind is in a thousand places at once. Meditation definitely helps you slow down that monkey mind brain and helps you focus more on the present moment um, because te we tend to overthink about the future or dwell and think about our past. Uh, meditation completely silences all that extra chatter and it helps you focus on right now and the present moment. I'm going to give you a couple tips that will help you with meditation and some things that help me along my journey. First things first is you're going to want to find a comfortable position. Okay, this can either be sitting, standing, or laying. A lot of people recommend that you don't lay when you first start meditating because it's more than likely you'll just fall asleep. And although sleeping has many benefits to it and is very, very important for our soul, the object, uh, I mean the point of doing all this isn't to fall asleep. It's to actually be in the present moment and be conscious uh, and be still. Your environment does matter. Um, you don't want to be in too much of a noisy environment where there's just a bunch of distractions. Uh, the th a thing I recommend to do is if you're in a house where it's pretty noisy, just pop in some headphones and look up frequencies or guided meditations. The reason why I'm saying these things is because I want you guys to get into a comfortable state, distraction free, so you're focusing on you and yourself only. Um, so once you kind of found a good spot to do it, you found a comfortable position, uh, I tend to focus on my breathing. Um, and not the traditional breathe in, breathe out. I actually like focusing on the feeling of air going into my nose and the feeling of me pushing it back out of my body. Um, kind of just to be appreciative of the life force energy running through me and be appreciative for being alive in this earth in general. Basically the main point in meditation is you are trying to be fully observed in the present moment. That means you don't want to be thinking too far ahead into the future and you don't want to be dwelling too far in the past. You want to be focused on this moment that you're giving yourself right now to completely let go and completely relax. When you go into this you'll realize that there's two parts of your mind. Your thoughts and then there's you sitting with your thoughts and actually observing those thoughts. You want to focus on being the observer of your thoughts and not just your thoughts. You want to detach from your thoughts completely and become that observer to it. Meditation helps you bring balance to your inner world. Like When you think about peace, you're never going to find peace outside of yourself. You're always going to have to find peace within. And the main journey for meditation is Coming at peace with yourself. So another tip I have is drop all expectations you have of meditation and how it's supposed to go. Let it go how it goes. Don't expect to see anything, hear anything, just completely have no expectations. All you need to focus on is relaxing and letting go. And the reason why I tell people this is because a lot of people will expect the meditation to be a certain way and when it's not that way they give up completely on meditation and meditation is one of those things like riding a bike when you pick it up the first time you're not going to be able to ride that bike it takes you a few times to be able to ride the bike right same with meditation it's going to take you a few tries okay and maybe even more than a few tries you got to get disciplined and keep practicing and I promise you'll get benefits and I don't want to talk about too much of the benefits, but I promise you, you will notice the benefits and you'll feel it. It's a feeling and it's a feeling that, like I said, I want you to find it out for yourself. The last tip I have is try to take your meditation one sense at a time, okay? That means we have different senses, right? Sight, taste, hearing. I want you to focus on one of those senses at a time. When you close your eyes, what do you hear? Focus on that. When you breathe in, what do you smell? 
focus on that. When you're eating, what do you taste? Focus on that. And I don't have to keep explaining. You guys know what's up. You guys just focus on one sense at a time and really absorb the present moment. Don't chew your food thinking about a million things going on. Really just think about each flavor and take your time and really enjoy it and be in the present moment. And uh, when you start getting good at meditating, you'll realize that you don't have to be still to meditate. You can meditate any time of the day with any activity. It's just basically the mindset that you're in. You don't always have to do the guided meditation. I just recommend you do it at first if you kind of want an idea of meditation. But another thing that I like to use are frequencies. If you type 432 hertz, uh, there's different type of frequencies that do different things. So definitely research the different uh, benefits from each of the frequencies. Um, but yeah, I use frequencies as well to help me with meditation. Uh, another thing I like to do is just go to a nature spot and I'll start to just listen to nature and the animals and the trees, the wind, all that. And I'll kind of just find myself centered and letting go of all my tension, letting go of all my expectations, letting go of all those negative thoughts that I've had or dwelling on the past or thinking about what my future is gonna look like. I give myself a chance to take a break from life and from that monkey mind and really just connect to my higher self. And they say the more you meditate, you'll start to realize who you truly are. And you'll be able to answer questions that you didn't know you had the answers to. It really just takes it really just takes patience. You will get there. And I am very proud of you guys for even looking up this video to improve your health and improve yourself. And we are all on this journey together. And I just want to say, y'all know what it is. Keep it G. Keep it real. Keep it energy. You know what I'm saying? Keep it energy. And it's Queen Chosen signing out. See you next time.